love the galaxies and rays. I thought that I was going crazy. You took me to another place, another big bang explosion. What's up, everybody? Welcome to. <laughs> this is so cool. Like to actually say it. I feel like um, I'm doing something special or something. I don't know. But welcome to the the official Pop Kid Nick Nick Carter. Not really Nick Carter, but Pop Kid Nick right now. That's my alter gaming ego for you guys on here. And welcome to the page. Um, like I said, I'm trying to do this as much as possible uh, to. You know, keep you guys informed, keep you guys updated on things that are going on, you know, um, maybe a little bit of entertainment right now, um, and some video game playing and chatting and hanging out. You see this background? I worked really hard on this last night. Um, so, uh, uh, Neurotic Tonic, which is on, that's one of my moderators, also one of my, uh, one of my other moderators uh, is Kat. I think she should be on as well. Any questions that you guys have or things that you, um, you know, might want to get to me, um, you know, as far as the experience goes with this page, feel free to go ahead and reach out to them. Um, they'll get back to you as soon as possible. And like I said, go ahead and follow. You can see the updates through my uh, official uh, Twitter pages and my Instagram pages uh, as well. Um, and then also the uh, Popkid Nick um, uh, Twitter and Instagram page there too. Um, also, just a little update. Uh, on where you can go if you want to play video games with me. 
um, which is the main reason I started this uh, because I'm a I love gaming. It's like one of my favorite things. Um, haven't done it in a little while. I'm starting to get back into it and seeing how I can kind of like integrate it a little bit into um, my daily routine with my children, which is obviously most important right now. So um, I'm trying to just kind of uh, create some structure uh, of how we're going to actually work this channel in the first place. So, but, um, you know, so I just put my, let me show you real quick. <laughs> But Searsha, she's in bed right now. You can't see it because the, the augmented stuff is going on. So I'm watching her on the camera as I am gaming and chatting with you guys. Um, to all the fans all around the world, anybody who has just officially joined this page, you can, I, I guess you can follow me on the, um, the Twitch page. And um, also feel free to follow because... Uh, there is my profile, which I'm I'm gonna be playing g different games from all sorts of different um, uh, uh, places, such as Steam, which is one of my favorites. Which I'm gonna probably try to play a game from there today. But if you join and you follow me, you might be able to, if you have that client, to jump in and play a game with me if you want. So um, you can go to let me see on Steam. Uh, my profile is. I believe it's pop, it is Pop Kid Nick, um, and uh, hopefully, hopefully you'll be able to find that on Steam. I'm gonna go ahead and I'm getting into the obviously since you can see in the back, I'm getting into the Halloween October cool off month sort of spirit. Um, fall's coming around. We're super excited about that. Uh, I said this before. My whole family we're we're totally into like the whole. Uh, ghouls and goblins and ghosts and witches, oh my. Uh, <laughs> so, uh, no, we're, uh, so we're totally getting ready. So in honor of that, I'm going to start playing some scary games this month. Um, I'm watching scary movies and I'm playing scary games. And one of my favorite games is a game called Left 4 Dead. Um, I'm a huge Valve fan. Obviously, Valve uh, was a part, like um, Half-Life was really what got me into, um, into, the, uh, the Valve and the G Gabe Newell, right? Neurotic? <laughs> and Gabe Newell, um, who actually was is the legend as far as Valve goes. Um, let me see if there got any requests from you on uh, the Pop Kid Nick uh, Steam channel. That's the client I'm going to use when I play Left 4 Dead. But anyways, uh, trying not to be so long-winded, but um, yeah, I'm a huge fan of, of all the Valve games, and since I have my own channel, I can actually complain about some things right now. And I'm going to say this right now. Obviously, they did the right thing, and they came with uh, the new Half-Life. Um, I do believe that it should ha – I don't know if it has yet. Um, correct me if I'm wrong, Neurotic. But it was only set up for VR. And if, and if, that's, if that's the case, um, they need to bring that uh, – you know, they need to convert it so that everybody can play that game just, you know, on whatever Xbox, any sort of – uh, game con console, in my opinion. So I'm happy that they did that, but um, we are waiting, Gabe and Valve. Where the hell is Left 4 Dead 3? That is my. That is what I'm going to complain about right now. Where? They don't do threes. Well, they call it something out else. Like you don't have to call it three. Just bypass the three. Just go right to four. I don't know. Like this. This is probably one of the best games that I've ever played in my life. I, I, I it's probably hard for me to really rate like my favorite games um, because I, I, I have so many different styles of games that I like, whether they're FPSs or or whether they are um, role playing games. Um, but this was definitely, I think, probably top ten for me. So Left 4 Dead. So we'll play that a little bit later in the meantime, and then also um, I will answer some questions, chat with you guys a little bit. Um, I hope you guys like the whole new background in the spirit of Halloween coming up. Um, and it's so funny because I, I've been so out of touch with like technology um, that because I've been busy, I've been raising a family. So, but I've been so out of touch that I'm like, what the hell happened? Five years went by like that, and I'm like, what is all this new stuff? And so Neurotic tells me he said, he goes, he's like Nick, you know, you you don't even have to get a green screen anymore. You could just like have it virtually sort of you know superimposed in the back, and I'm like, 
okay, so what do I need for that? He's like, well, just go get like the, make sure you get a GTX. I'm like, dude, I don't even, RTX, I had a GTX. <laughs> That's right, I had a, I had a GTX. <laughs> it was so freaking prehistoric. I couldn't do anything. I was like, my mouse was like, just like dragging and everything like that. Anyways. So I finally got it, and now that's why I'm able to do this. And I'm also using uh, Twitch Studio Beta right now, um, which is really uh, user friendly. Oh, looks looks like people just joined me. Uh, Neurotic, I have 56 new invites for Steam. Nice. I haven't even accepted a lot of these. Oh, somebody here has Ishi82 has a Buccaneers flag. I'm gonna accept you be just because of that. <laughs> Anyways, we're gonna have some fun. I'm gonna play some music. I start. Um, I've been playing music from um, a, a little bit from the last album that I did, the All American album, and and then so I went back a little bit further, and this was actually an album I, I haven't heard in a long time. It is the I'm Taking Off record, and that song I'm Taking Off, probably one of my favorite songs that I've ever written. Um, but in the meantime, before we ask questions, I'll go ahead and play another song as I'm accepting. Uh, people right now on on Steam, and when I get in, hopefully, because uh, what like Left 4 Dead's like only four people. We'll play. We'll we'll shoot some zombies if you don't mind. All right, I'll play some more music. Uh, let me mute my microphone. Here's another song off of the I'm Taking Off. <laughs>
That's a pretty vibey song, huh? Anyways, uh, that was... Why don't I just stop the playlist? What am I doing? That's my, uh, in this entire platform. Anyways, uh, I'm going to go ahead and take some questions from you guys. I'm going to go ahead and give Cat a quick call. And... She's special. Hey, okay, so uh, go ahead and uh, I'll answer some questions if you want to pick some out for me. So, uh, how you doing, Kara? Um, the question is from Kara. If I could build my own video game, what kind would it be, and what would it be like? Um, God, uh, you know, I, I, I really love role-playing games. Um, there was a game I was playing um, recently that it, it was kind, it was kind of like a space uh, type type game. Ah, what is it called? Um, I got to but it, anything that has sort of like where you can, like I do love the FPS games and um, being able to jump in really fast. But there's something about being able to just like shut shut off and you know and just kind of like immerse yourself into you know a character for for an entire you know length. Um, uh, Prey. That was the game. One of the baddest games I think I've ever ga played was uh, Prey. I played it on Xbox um, and. It was just like I don't know if you guys seen that game or heard of it. Um, it was just games that have like puzzles in it, games that where you can solve problems, games that that um, are challenging in that way. Um, you know, there there was this game I actually just uh, started playing it was called Sekiro, um, and the uh, the newer version version of it. And when I say I've never played a game harder than that, that was it. Uh, but it would have to be any. Anywhere along the lines of something that has just sort of like a role playing, so I'd probably do like anything that was like you know space or e even Skyrim was great. So I'd probably try to create a role playing type of game. I think that'd be fun. Any other questions? <laughs> so so someone. I think a lot of people, uh, like a few people, were asking about the Lance meeting. Um, we had a great conversation yesterday, and we're still, we're still talking. That's all I can say right now. Um, Lance is a great guy. I love him. Uh, we, we have uh, started to develop a really cool relationship. He's um, incredibly talented, um, you know, as a producer, and he's he has like the greatest ideas. And so, you know, we had a Zoom call, and we're. We're just chatting. So um, when when we uh, are prepared to make the announcement of what it's going to be, you will be the first to know. Trust me. <laughs> Anything else? You there? Hey, cat. Sorry. No worries. So, uh, Chrissy. Is that her? Uh, if I could have, if I could have any game um, feature or any song of ours, probably I'd say Backstreet Boys or or you know one of my own featured in the game. Which one would that be? Well, gosh, I mean, I guess you have to choose Backstreet's Back. You know, everybody Backstreet's Back because uh, you know we had the opportunity to perform uh, that song um, in the movie uh, uh, This Is the End, and that was a lot of fun because it just it's a song that just just. I guess it, it feels like it's timeless. It's a song that that is a little spooky. And it has like a a lot of character to it. Literally, if you watch the music video, there's a lot of character to it. Um, but yeah, it's uh, um, one of my. I think one of the songs that I think you could probably plug into to a movie um, that has just a little suspense to it. Maybe I don't know something like that. Any other questions? So. Pam asked, hi, Pam, how you doing? What am I going to be for Halloween this year? Uh, so we haven't sort of worked out. There's a couple of things. One, I would 
possibly. Okay, so we literally have Ghostbusters on replay. One and two on replay throughout the house. And the Ghostbusters cartoons, I'm sure you, you know. So, I mean, literally, I'm playing... Like, that's a part of, like, Odin's mix. Like, he loves the, the Ray Parker Ghostbusters song. So, we were like, well, maybe we'll just... Maybe we'll just all be Ghostbusters. I don't know. Um, and, uh, but, and then there was, like, this really, like, small little, like, Ghostbuster for, a, like, an outfit or a costume for a baby. So, that could be super adorable uh, for Saoirse. So, uh, maybe. Maybe, like, Ghostbusters or... Maybe, like, the typical Nightmare Before Christmas kind of vibe. You know, maybe I could be Jack Skeleton again. Did it on Dance with the Stars. Um, but just do it at my house or something. I don't know. Any other questions out there? Well, <coughs> that uh, leads me to a really cool, so, um, thing. I'm trying to see how I can share this with you guys. I'll pull both of them up. Um, maybe I'll be able to pull it up over here. So, would I, uh, so who was it from again? So Krista asked if I would consider having my, my voice or image used in a video game. Um, I think that would be the coolest honor ever uh, to be sort of inserted into you know, a video game. Um, yeah, I think that would be amazing. And even too, I think would be better is if it was like anonymous. Like nobody actually knew that you were in it and that you knew and, and then maybe so they found out like, later on that oh my god he was a part of whatever you know and um that leads me to talking about something so i posted something a couple months back on um let me see if i can go to it real fast i posted something on my instagram about fortnite and so i had a, a buddy of mine his his name is um will and he uh worked at uh, epic games and so when I was first, um, this was like before my, my son was born, or actually pr probably right around when he was really small, so I was able to play a lot more. Um, and, and I was searching online. I was like, man, I'm trying to find like something like that I could play like multiplayer because I love multiplayer games, you know, um, Battlefields and, you know, uh, Modern War, all those things, um, Call of Duties. Um, I love those games. And I was trying to find something that I could just like play cooperatively, you know, with with fans or even just my family and friends, you know, because that's like some of my favorite just to kind of be like a part of a team. And so I'm searching online and then I, I saw this, there was like this thing about games that were going to come out or that were in development and there was this one game and I searched through this whole list and Fortnite had come up. And I, um, I was like, oh, this is really interesting. I said, well, maybe I could like, you know, maybe email these guys be like, hey, I'm Nick Carter from the Backstreet Boys. Could you like let me try the game out? And I got this call back from this guy named Will, and he's like, "Yeah, I work at Epic. You know, we'll give you like a key. We'll let you try it out, and you can like beta test it." And so, be, like years before the game had even come out, I had I was testing the game, and you know, it was even where the interface had completely changed. You know, all the 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 weapon selection screens, everything there was. And so then when I was on tour, um, we had I think we were on the in a world like this tour. And we had come through, um, so I can't remember exactly where their studios are, but we had we stopped by, and I, he invited me to the studio, and I took a, a tour through, you know, obviously the Epic Game Studios, and they showed me all these, like, all the, the different programmers and everyone working on it. They had their screens out. They were taking trees, and they were just, like, you know, moving them around and, and you know, you know, interchanging things, taking things out, doing the whole, I mean, it was, like, there was a, a staff of like 20 different programmers. If it, it felt like that were just all programming. And at that time I was like, I'm like, I was like, nudge him. Like, hey, you know, uh, maybe like I could like do a character voice or something like that. Maybe they're like, yeah, whatever. <laughs> but at that time they knew that they had something really, really big and they were, um, they were just, they were super sweet and everything. But I snuck a little picture 
um, of it. And I had like some of the first development things. I wonder if I could pull it up right now. Let me see if I can show it to you. Mm -hmm. Maybe I just do a screen share. Maybe that's what I do. There we go. See, let's just do that one real quick. Save. No. Can you see anything? No. Yeah, this is. Um, I hope I could pull it up because I say what? Oh, that's that cat. That's like that's my bee right back. You want to see this? Uh, this is like super fun. Like in this program. <laughs> Look at so when I'm like, hey, I'll be right back. Wait, where is it at? Look, that's my, I I changed it because it's like be right back, and I'm like, no, nah, stay cool and chill. <laughs> and I, I just took one of their. They're they're pre. Look at, look at that look at that kitty cat. <laughs> That's a cool cat right there. <laughs> oh my god. Um. All right. So yeah. Let me see how I could share this. Maybe I'll just try a new one. Add lay layout. Yeah. Um. Where is it? Main screen. Screen share. Maybe try that one. And then I go to to the where's it at? Where's it at? Microsoft. Maybe it's that one stream. Da -da -da. Oh, I see where I go. Okay, yeah. Um, and any other questions while I'm trying to figure this out? <laughs> I'm still learning on the job. Hey, I'm back. Hi. Um, yeah, I'll like I'll answer some questions while they're. Ooh, good question. Be right back. <laughs> good question. Be right back. No, my uh, favorite video game when I was younger. Um, so obvious, obviously, I was. I'm gonna. You know what? I'll figure this thing out later. For some reason, I can't share this picture. You can go to my Instagram if you want to see it. There's pictures there of I, I took of, of basically behind the scenes at the Epic Games Studio at Fortnite. In the meantime, I'll figure this out later on because I think it's probably more interesting this way. Hey, I could, that's right, cat. I can tweet it later. Be like, I could drive people to my socials. Not a bad idea. No. Um, so my favorite video game when I was a kid, um, I started playing, I mean, I, I started playing Nintendo, which was the first thing I ever played. I was more of a Nintendo kid than I was a Sega kid. A lot of people like to have this debate. Which one was better, Sega or Nintendo? Nintendo, in my opinion, they're still here. And uh, there were some great Sega games, obviously. Uh, Sonic was great. But I started with the Mario, but I really fell in love with uh, Zelda. Uh, A Link to the Past was probably my favorite game with, uh, on, um, on Super Nintendo, I think it was on. And it was just what an incredible game. I'll, I'll never forget, like, sitting in my house and outside there was – you know, it was like storming a lot in Tampa where I lived. And I'll never forget like that moment, like I was playing in the game and, and like I was Link and it was like storming and you could like do like this supercharge and like hit these, these uh, trees and like bees would come out. And it was just so interactive, but it was like storming outside. So I was like, I'll never forget sitting there playing that game. It was like one of the most incredible games. So Zelda Link to the Past was definitely one of my favorite games. Um, let me see. I'll do one more question. Uh, and... If they have anything, I'm going to still try to get this thing going. Mm. Yeah, the uh, the children's book. Um, let me see the main screen. If it's over there. Um, yeah, so working. Let's get out of there. I'll fix this crap later. Just stay cool and chill. <laughs> <laughs> um, maybe I'll just do game share in a little bit. Uh, webcam. Uh, dude, chatting. That's what I wanted. Okay, so the children's book is something that I'm definitely working on. Um, we're we're in the process of uh, talking with. Um, uh, um, can't think off the top of my head. Publishers. Talking to publishers, talking to illustrators, um, doing that entire process right now. So that is, um, it's it's a lot of fun. But we want we want to make sure that it's it's right and that it's that it's something that that could, uh, you know, be great for my children and 
everyone else's children out there in the world, something that they could read and just something that's inspiring and something that, um, you know, you know, everybody can relate to. And that's, um, that's what's most important about, especially a, a, a children's book, something that's very universal, but also something that comes from the heart. So we're working on that right now. So, all right. So switching gears, um, I'm wondering if, let me go to the webcam in a second. Let's play some games. Play some games with my heart. Um, if you guys can get in on Steam, and you can play, tell me, tell me it's gonna work. Please work. It's not working, is it? Can you hear the music? It was like the best music in the world. Yeah. You can't hear it. You should be able to hear it. Report unusual behavior. Barricade your home. That's it. No, that's it. Avoid all contact with infected individuals. Wait for official instructions. <laughs> Wait my ass. Get all sons of bitches. That's my official instructions. I hope that I can get this working, dude. I'm trying so hard to just do, uh... Looks like there's been a change of plans. Stop the bombing okay, I got it. I got it. I found it. Studio beta, and I Holy think I might use some OBS because this is not working the way I wanted it to. Change. <clears throat> oh, there we go. Hey, kill all sons of bitches, right? Should be okay. Okay. Yeah. I did it. I've been dying to play this game. Ooh, I should. What the heck? Can they see the game? You can see my mouse? Save it. Let me see what happens if I just go back to. All right. L4D. In the meantime, while I'm setting it all up, I'll play another song for you guys because 
I can. <laughs> Check this one out. I did it. I feel accomplished. <laughs> I did it. Okay. So we are. I, you saw it. I just had it. What? I have no idea. You do realize this is a beta program, right? So it's probably capture from refresh. We refresh everything. How about just refresh everything? Maybe that's a good idea. Refresh things. not okay oh my goodness me all right so let's try this again uh, change it go to l4d done maybe I should do compatibility capture I I'm about to go back to OBS in a second. This is crazy. So what are they saying? All right, so any help out there? Is this just one of those things I should just go back to OBS real fast in order to make this work?
Okay, cool. So I'm going to trust and listen to these people, and unless I can try one more time. Yeah. We might fail at this. Um, maybe just try it one more time. Uh, it's left or dead. The uh, second one. Maybe that. No. Maybe. Try it again. Maybe try compatibility capture, see what happens there. It's a really dude. Come on. All right. I think it's good to go. We can play. All right, I'm gonna play campaign. Quick match. Let's try it. All right. It's been a while, but it should be like riding a bike. Oh, my daughter's still sleeping. How's the screen look, cat? All right, let's go. I swear this is like my favorite. I have not played this game probably in like, I don't even know how many years. I'm freaking lost! And all my people are gone! I'm coming guys! Sit tight! Hey, anyone out there? Put you at. Missed all the Good action. Enough. Back at him, Nick. How's the uh, volume? Thanks, man. I owe you. We cool. Me How's the volume, cat? Good. Everything good? Any level issues? All right. We 
got some laser sights. Take a laser sight. Sweet. Don't worry. Don't worry. The hero is gone. It's just three. Hey, Kat, ask them if it was that compatibility button. It felt like that was what it was. Step slow, y'all. Really Boom around. If anybody knows. God damn it, I can't This shot's gonna work. Oh, he Miro is back. I really screwed the boots back there. is a tank slayer. <coughs> Effects? Okay. Yeah, I should be able to. Options. So Alice. Zoe, huh? So are you saying you audio effects? Yeah. I was thinking of her too, Nick. <coughs> I, I, I don't think that that's, um, she is totally out of was it, does everybody have that issue when they're listening to it? Oh, sorry. Look out! Watch out! I know you're mad, Nick. We have guns here. Step slow, y'all. I still think Boom that like, they're all. Oh, yeah. I still think that the 
Valve's um, just their whole gameplay is so smooth. Alright, Oh crap! Frick a tank! Where's the music though? Oh shit! Mess some shit up. Let's try upstairs. Nice. You can have this. Thanks. I appreciate it. That'll keep me tight. Quit fussing and let me hear you. We got guns. Thank you, Oasis. Yes. Dark heck. Sounds like one of them smoker bitches. Also, another game I really loved, um, which I'm sure everybody loved. Whoa! Was, uh. Portal. That's what it was. Portal. Hey, cat. While I'm playing, if they have any questions, I'm totally cool to answer. Don't be messing with the AC. Oh, the witch! Did I really just piss her off? She's after me! Thanks, Wacy. Thanks. You are welcome. Here. It hurts. Cat, I'll call you right back. Here right. you go. Had no use for this anyhow. I ain't gonna get shot. Neurotic. That's what I'm talking about. Do you see? I, I'm in. I, dude, I had such a hard time getting into the game. I think there was a button where I had, it was like a compatibility button. This is a real and once I hit that, it let me in. Yeah, through Steam, but I had to hit. No, no, no. Uh. Uh, left for dead. Oh god, the jockey's got one of my people. No! Oh yeah, dude, Friday the 13th is so dope. Oh no. Yeah, no, I, I, that's another game. Tell them that's another game I want to play. right now okay there we go yeah so friday the 13th is, is kind of like a phase really cool survival game Shit, um, i played a little bit of it done. on my xbox the other night and i was down the stairs um <laughs> this is gonna be fun brandon dude is down <laughs> uh was i supposed to be okay Oh, but yeah, that's a that's a game I want to play as well. Cause it's it's like it's a survival game. Oh, Let's get out of the water. Any questions? Neurotic. I did some, but I was gonna. Why? Why is that dude like extra hard? Sorry. I'm grabbing some first aid. Su Susie who? Susie 2021. 
Oh, yeah. Do I? Okay, so Suzy2021 has a, a question. Do I have a favorite horror I movie? Oh, damn. I hit the alarm. I shouldn't have done that. Nobody was ready. Oh, shit! They're on their way. Anyways, my favorite horror movie that I watch over and over again. Um, I love Hellraiser. That's like one of my favorite movies ever. Get off of me. Hellraiser is so good. It's just a good script and I get a good storyline, like from top to finish. Um, but like, really, it's like Hellraiser, and then people don't really think about it. But Alien and Aliens are like one of the most horrific, or scary movies that you can ever watch. I think it's like, you know what I mean? Event Horizon. Um, how do they get up there, and why am I down here? Oh, there we go. Oh. Uh, uh, what was that one movie? It was the, the Korean-made movie that had the... It was this monster that was in the... Like, in the city? No. Um, it was like this crazy water monster. Watch out! I thought that one was really good. Kelsey Christine asked, what's my favorite favorite 90s rock My favorite 90s rock song? <sighs> well, obviously the whole um I should have learned to drive a tank or some shit. Uh the whole I hope that girl is still waiting for us. Oh no, she ain't going um, nowhere. Kind of alternative rock was like my favorite. I you know, loved it, and um, but went through Nirvana, loved Nirvana, and then also loved. Uh, but but I really settled, and I I was just thinking about this the other day. I went through a really big Lincoln Park stage as well, and um, but I really settled after all these all of these years on um, Stone Temple Pilots as being my favorite 
SDP hands down just as musicians leading all the way up from from when it started their you know how they evolved I just thought that they were like they turned out to be my favorite um, and so my favorite song is actually a song off of it's a deep cut off of the album four uh, and it's called Atlanta it's one of my favorite songs it has like a, almost like a it almost has like a it's kind of like a Doors vibe, the side. but, yeah, I, but it, that's here. like a little bit more of the okay. artsy kind of song and emotional you know song of them, here. their catalog, but we lost the man. I then really sure also, um, yeah. I mean, we'll help you. that you whole core album us? was incredible. Sorry, I really am. You seem nice, but... I have a really cool story, so when we were now fill up that generator. recording, get you on your I think it was our, our, um... Nick, you shot me. Yeah, why you shoot me, Nick? Um, so when we were recording one of our albums, Ellis, keep your mind on the camera. Studio not was, the girl. but SCP was in the same studio as us, and they were recording twelve gracious melodies. Scott Lyle walking through the studio, and they were recording that whole album. But we were in there, I think, doing demos or something. We hadn't even really broken. We were just kind of experimenting. It was just a gas tank. Yeah. Uh, Scott he had like this crazy, like, uh, up here. Uh, I think like pink or purple at the time. They were really nice. They were recording one of my favorite albums, that album. They had a big FD on it. Oh, this, this round. Erotic. This round was like one of the hardest because you had to take all these gas tanks, fill these up. They were so hard. Oh, really? See uh, the default mic. What about this? Well, because I gotta get, I get. What about now? Reloading. Should be a lot louder now. Is that better? Yeah, I'm in. Hey, right, let me heal you, bud. Wait. Wait. No, nope, I want to heal them. So these settings are good? All right. Anyway, so repeating the story um, and answering the question if they didn't catch it because it was too low. Um, my favorite song is off of an, uh, is in group is STP and, um, hold on a second. Save that, save it. Oh, that's great, of course. Can they hear me now? Oh, dude. Okay, thank you. Um. That's what I'm saying. I'll, I'll re-answer the question. What was my favorite 90s song? Answer the question. It's a song called Atlanta uh, off of STP's album. STP is I, I settled on STP as my favorite band after all those years. Um, love Nirvana, obviously. Pearl Jam. Um, Linkin Park. You know, totally miss like a lot of the rock rap, rock rap uh, music. Um, but Atlanta is like one of my favorite songs um, off of that that album. Oh, really? Help! Help! Uh, but then when I went to the uh, the reason I it was really crazy because at the time that I was a huge 
uh, fan of, of Stone Temple Pilots at that time. Oh, I'm dead. What can I do? Um, we were recording with the Backstreet Boys in the studio at the same time when we were doing our first album and our demos uh, in the same studio as Stone Temple Pilots. And I remember seeing they were – I think they were recording at the time, you know, the 12 Gracious Melodies. I can't remember which album they were recording, um, but that was uh, – it was really cool to be in the same studio as Stone Temple Pilots. I got this one. Any other questions? I got it. Who is it? Lou Lilla, 89. Oh, I got to get out of this game. Sears is awake. But, uh, okay, if I could be a video game character, what? Mm -hmm. So if I could be a video game uh, character and not myself, who would I want to be? Um, I think I'd probably... I still... I love Link. You know, like, I go back to Link. That, that would be awesome to be... Or maybe someone from, uh, you know, Final Fantasy... Um, Final Fantasy VII, um, love, loved that game. That was one of my favorite games of all time. And um, but, yeah. All right. Well, listen. I'm getting ready to log off soon because um, I gotta go take care of some responsibilities. But I will leave you all with a song if I can put it on to end the the stream. Where is it at? Uh, where did I put that thing at? But don't go. Is this this isn't really that interesting? I mean, I'm just like sitting around and just not doing anything. And, uh, I just had that thing going. Absolutely. Well, I probably won't be able to end off with the song because I don't have it all set up properly. But listen, I just wanted to say thank you so much for joining me. Um, we are working out the kinks right now on this entire Twitch page that you will be able to go back and rewatch. Uh, so we're we're sharing it, and you can check it out. Um, get caught back up on anything that you missed. But this will be, again, like I said, the place that you can come to, hang out with me, um, get some updates. This is the only place that you're going to get thing, hear things and learn things that, that, uh, and get updates on things that you, you won't be able to get anywhere else. This is, this is the place that it's going to be. This is the place that, that I'm going to call my home. You can see that's like Pop Kid Nick's house. This is Pop Kid Nick's house. Um, I thank you so much for joining me and, um, Download, if you can, on any of the, the, the gaming platforms, whether it's Blizzard, that's going to be Pop Kid Nick. So if you want to play with me, you can go there, or you can go to Steam, or you can uh, go to Origin. I created a Pop Kid Nick there. That will be my profile there. Also, um, I think on Ubisoft, I did there. And so it's, on, it's pretty much on all the gaming pl platforms. Pop Kid Nick will be my gamer tag. And we can play video games there. So anyways, it was great hanging with you all. Um, I love you again so much. Thank you for being great fans, and thanks for um, being patient with me during this crazy learning process of the Popkin Nick stream. So you guys be safe out there. Love you.